Welcome to Mish Plays Video Games and Stuff. I hope you hate it. Today's game. Hey friends, welcome back to Mish Plays Fire Emblem. We're playing in Fire Emblem and Fire Emblem. And blam, blam. So anyway, I remember the thing I was trying to talk about and forgot what I was talking about. Um, or got distracted or something. Uh, you guys were mentioning that... Obviously, like, uh... The characters you use more are the ones that are gonna get stronger and stuff. As in, um... You know, like, when people get in fights, they get more experience and stuff. And, I, like, Wrath got a whole bunch of experience for killing that one pseudo-boss guy in the over-ish world. Dang, look at all that updates. But, like, the characters I use more are gonna obviously get stronger, which is kind of weird, because some of the times the characters I want to get stronger are not always the optimal to use in any given situation. Like, Kent and Sane kind of sprint in and kill everything, while, you know, even Lindis does not get as much action as I would like her to. And then, like, it's like characters like Dorcas, like, he's been through like three fights and done nothing. So he's never gonna be good. I mean, what's an axe good for? <laughs> um. But I don't know, it's just something to think of. And you guys mentioned, like, Sarah I should use a lot, because then her healing gets better and she gets spells and it can actually, like, fight stuff. Yeah, you guys are spoiling everything for me. Don't let me in figure it out for myself. I'm kind of scared of the stairway. I don't know what's gonna take me. But you know, nothing ventured, nothing gained. But actually, first of all, I'm gonna check how far this guy can move. Well, oh, I'll be fine. Sarah's gonna heal, um, Kentaroni. <sighs> so my coffee got so cold that I just had to go get something else to drink. So now I got this Town Club Strawberry Soda. You guys asked me to tell stories, so here's a little story. Um, I do not live in a very quaint part of the city. I live in kind of, you know, an unfriendly part. Not, not not unfriendly. It's just, it's a city. It's, I live in Milwaukee, okay? It's Milwaukee. It's not, like, super, I don't know what you call it. I just got a hammer. What the hell is a hammer for? What the hell is a hammer for? I live in Milwaukee. It's 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 Milwaukee. It's kind of grungy. It's got that grungy feel to it. It's not very quaint at all. But anyway, I went to a, a BP, a gas station near where I live, and found this these uh, bo this bottled soda called Town Club. And I tried this. It, they had like cream soda, and it was really delicious. And it was like it's got a very simplistic bottle. And it's, it was just good soda, and it was only like a dollar for 16 ounces, which is, some, which is actually kind of weird, considering you pay like a dollar and a half for a stupid bottle of plastic bottle Pepsi puke word cuss stuff. I don't know, but it was just a quaint little thing, because now I got this. Um, dude, I am terrible at multitasking and finishing statements and words. But I, I, I found this, like, weird, obscure soda in, like, this gas station near where I live. I feel like it, j it could just become that kind of thing where it's, like, uh... It becomes... You know, like, like that secret place you have where you go to hide. Or, like, that little quaint, cutesy th snack you like. I don't know. I, um... This made more sense before I tried to vocalize it. How it's like, you got, there's a little, little something that, you know that, you know that feeling you get when you watch Sandlot? You just, uh, it's like, <laughs> I don't know, the, the simple pleasures in life, and enjoying the simple pleasures in life, and I found this like, I don't know, out, weird soda. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. <laughs> How can you guys? How can you guys like listening to this crap? What am I saying? Ugh. But anyway, yeah, I found this this weird um, soda in the gas station nearby. 
and it's really delicious stuff, and I feel like it could just be like that thing, like, oh yeah, I'm gonna go across the street and get myself that delicious strawberry soda, or that delicious cream soda. Because that's what I do. That's what makes this place home. That's what makes it special. I wonder if Matthew can do anything. Okay, he can attack. He has an iron sword. Get him. Smack him. And he's gonna attack back and mess me up. Wow, I'm faster than him, at least. He looks like he's wearing jeans and sneakers. <laughs> There's a story, I guess. <laughs> Man, I'm all over the place. I'm pretty bad at this Let's Play thing. <laughs> Sane, you're getting left behind. <laughs> he's sane. He's never left behind. He can move like 50 squares in a turn. Hideyoshi Baka asks, So if Mish is Mish, and Bert is Urk, who is everyone else? Well, I don't know, it's one of the great mysteries of the world, isn't it? <laughs> I thought that was kind of funny. I don't know. It'd be kind of weird trying to uh, assign... Oh my goodness, is Linda's gonna die? Oh my goodness. Can can people apply vulneraries to other people? This is what I mean. Linda's is kind of trailing behind in all the stats because she doesn't get much action. I swear, if Lin, <gasps> I'm really scared that Linda's is actually gonna die. And apparently that um, stairway there isn't anything. <laughs> but anyway, if Mish is Mish. And Bert is Urk. I mean, Urk is Bert, and then who is everyone else? Good question. Nils seems a little bit dubsy. Uh, Sane also keeps, seems kind of dubsy. Sane definitely seems wan ish, though. Wan seems. Oh my god! No, no, no! No, 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 no! Okay, okay. Alright, alright, we're good. We're good. We're good. We are good a rooney. Lindus is Lindus. I don't even know what Lindus is. Um, Cynical Sam. Cynical Sam could be someone. Maybe Wrath is Cynical Sam. No, maybe Kent. Nah, nah, Kent. Kent's not cynical, he's just kind of stick up with the buttish. You know, free Dick about Tuesdays. All that jazz. <laughs> Mish, what are you talking about? Ugh. Uh, Yeah, there's no way he's gonna die. Unless I swing No, he's not gonna swing twice. Alright, Kent will get him. Kent had better get him. Um, yeah, Sane seems kinda wannish, just cause the... The... The charisma, and the... The, the the lover boy ladies man type of thing going on there. <laughs> uh, we, oddly enough, we don't have many you know girls, so it's like you know I don't know. Um, there's no like girls that you could say, oh yeah, it's like Sarah. <laughs> Sarah can be Darvelina. <laughs> Sarah is kind of Darvelina-ish, isn't she? Just kind of doing things her way, and everyone's like, oh my goodness, kill me. <laughs> Urk's getting left behind, too. So let's see, who haven't I assigned to a person? Ugh, this is awkward. Because Wrath can't attack here, and Saint can't attack there. This is awkward. This is awkward! Uh, you know, I eat... Uh, 
This is so... <laughs> what am I doing? Was that due to bad planning? Ugh. Uh, let's deal with this for... Ooh, Lin actually has moved yet. How about that? That's a nice little tune. I don't know why the screen gets all weird like that. Sorry guys, I don't know what that's about. Well, this is awkward as all hell. Alright. Wrath is kinda low on health, so I want him to move back anyway. I want to move back beyond the range of what that guy can hit, so I move him there. And then Sane will move up. And then this guy will get mad. Oh look, another level up for Sane! He's level 8. Matthew should be fine there, because I don't think that guy's going to move an attack. <laughs> I got a hammer? What the hell is a hammer supposed to do for me? It's, it's for axe users. Maybe I'll give it to Dorcas. Maybe he'll stop sucking so much then. <laughs> well, I'm sure as soon as I beat this guy, I'm gonna get like... a whole bunch of cutscenes. So, uh, let's call it an episode here. Keep him pretty bite-sized. And, um... This is what I mean. If I'm keeping the videos pretty short, like... 10-15 minutes, then I, I can probably afford to put one out every day, because I'm going to have so many that I can just probably do that. So I think that's what I'll do. But, you know, I just thought I'd ask you guys what you guys think. And what your watching habits are. Um, but anyway, um, that's that. See you guys next time on Mish Plays Fire Emblem. <laughs>